Okay, go ahead and roll. Mm -hmm. Yep. So now we're going to continue to clean this site. Uh, we're going to make sure we get the periodontal ligament out. I do believe there might be a little bit more scar tissue in here. Just keep keep rolling that cow. Okay. Okay, go ahead and give me the other. I'm going to put the ozone gas in next. Almost done, by. <laughs> the ozone gas is what we do second. We're going to kind of quickly go through this because we're not all here for the fun and games. The ozone can be a little dry, so we'll suck it in so the patient doesn't have to smell it. It won't hurt anybody, it just can be a little dry and make people feel like they want to cough a little bit. We've got an upper extraction site that we've taken out, or an upper tooth that we've taken out. This site isn't that dirty. Okay, now I'm going to take our platelet-rich fibrin. Go ahead and suck it in there. I'm going to place that down into our site. Voila. Grab me the suit. And, and this is really all I wanted to show you. I'm going to go ahead and place like one little stitch in here to close this up really nicely. And that's how you properly take out a chronically infected wisdom tooth and use platelet-rich fibrin to cause it to heal well. Yeah, that's good.